The sunken city in Alexandria, Egypt. In the year 2001 AD, a French archaeologist named Frank Gatto and his research team came to Alexandria to search for the remains of a sunken ship. During the search, they found the sunken city. In the city of Alexandria, specifically, from the Silsila region in the east to the west of Kaibe Castle at Tabia, if there were facilities located in the current eastern port, but as a result of the exposure of the northeastern coast to subsidence, it affected the port, which led to the loss of most of it and became below the water level and can be seen by diving at the bottom of the port. The original Egyptian name of the city was Thonis, but it was later called Heraklion, and it consisted of several facilities, including an inner port with entrances for ships with oars and ships, and a peninsula on which remains of columns, red granite crowns, an obelisk, and statues of the Sphinx were found. Strabo believed that there was a temple Poseidon, the Greek god of the seas, and the palace that Antonio built to retire in, and also an island that was believed to be Innerdos and had a religious temple where he found Sphinx statues and a statue of a priest carrying canopic vessels. The city remained forgotten until the year 2001, and it is said that before that, the French mission headed by Gudio was able to find it again and recover many unique monuments, including a huge red granite statue with a height of more than 5 meters. Also, a statue of the gods Hopi and Khonsu, and a statue of a woman who is likely to be of the famous Ptolemaic queen Cleopatra, in addition to gold and silver utensils and many other antiquities displayed in the Maritime Museum, the National Museum, the Grand Museum and others. Thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe.